every now and then my wife and I like to go to cemeteries and graveyards. The older, the better. Today is no different. We are back here in Vivi, Indiana, and this seems to be the old side of the cemetery. Now, we've often passed this multiple times, but never really visited it. Today we will. Last week we was here in Vivi, Indiana for the black tulips and that beautiful, beautiful mansion. This week, we're here for the cemetery. Yeah, I came back out here to Vivi because some things Angie and I talked about when we was going through here last week, and I'll tell you about that at the end of today's video. Right now, let's look at some of these beautiful tombstones. Okay, I could either put music to this or just do some talking. We're gonna just do some talking. And if one of these tombstones stand out to me, we'll stop by it. I watched a video back a couple months ago. Uh, it had to do with a mirror, I believe. And some of these tombstones that are really, really difficult to read, like this one right down here, what they would do is they would take a mirror and have it positioned in such, such a way that it will put light on it and you was able to read it all. Every single bit of it. The mansion I showed you last week, the people, the guy that built the mansion, the family that built that mansion, he is buried here in this cemetery. Now I would imagine it's here in this old spot or the old side of the cemetery. If I see his name, I will get that on video. I love it when my wife is talking to me from that far of a distance. She don't seem to understand that I cannot hear her. <laughs> but yet she still talks. But look at these tombstones right here. Oh my God. Oh, this is, see, to me, these old tombstones is totally beautiful. This is my taste right here. You know, a little bit on the creepy side, the old historical look, the, uh, the, the, the colors faded away. Man, see, that's beauty to me, guys. That is absolutely gorgeous to me. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Well, she says you weren't talking to me. She was talking to Kid. And Kid's probably pulling her all over the place up here. But, man... Now, I would imagine they wouldn't definitely be burying people down here. Well, I don't know. There's a graves right over yonder here. I figured this would be a flooding spot. Huh. Maybe I'm wrong. There's graves right over yonder there, too. A little bit on the nippier side today. Although, you probably can't tell it in the video. Oh, I have on a thermal underneath this, but it's a little bit on the nippy side. Yesterday was 66 for the high. Today's 54, but the two days ago was 85. Springtime, you gotta love it, right? Hey, did you see this tombstone right here? That one? Yeah. Beautiful. Let me turn the camera around, y'all. Right there. I don't know if I'm getting it in, but right there. Man. And we just look right through here. We'll probably do a half a pan around. Oh, it's just gorgeous. Totally beautiful. Man. Could you live with this in your backyard? I could. I always kind of wanted to be a caretaker for a cemetery or graveyard. Always did. That would be hard, though, to mow through here. Because some of these tombstones, like the little ones on the ground, like these right here, like these teeny ones right through here and right there. You know, you'll be riding around through here on a lawnmower. Kind of paying attention to what you're doing and then you run across one of them. The next thing you know, quick. Bet you they've been hit multiple times. Uh, did you see the tombstone over there, Ange? Looks like a tree trunk. Yeah. I think Angie's wanting to go over towards this road. And that looks like a new site over there. We will not be going over there. Ange might. Me, that, that it's, it's interesting, but it doesn't interest me like this. There's a car and motorcycle show going on over yonder there in the town of Evie. <coughs> lots and lots of people over there. 
thought about walking through the town and maybe looking at some of the cars but downside to that is there is music because i was going to get it on video there is music although i can put my own music to the videos yeah but there's a lot of people i don't do crowds uh, leave it down in the comments how do you feel about crowds me not so much and we're up on top of a little monument hill uh it's just a dirt, you, dirt mound. It's a dirt mound. You want to go over to the new side? No, I'm fine. Yeah, stained glass windows right there in that building. I see that. So you want to walk a little bit around yonder that way and go back towards the car? Sure. All right. We're headed back around that way. There's people over there. Look at this thing, uh, stained glass window, y'all. Looks like an eyeball right there. And I can see through to the other side. That's stained glass, too. Isn't that beautiful? When I was born, I lived in a big, huge mansion. Let me explain. It was old and beat up mansion, but still in all, it was a mansion. It has some storm glass or stained glass windows in that too. Okay, I was gonna go to the other side. It's probably the same as that one. So let's keep on the road and travel around. Real quick, y'all, I just asked Angie, does she want to trade? I take over Kit and she can finish out the vlog. I don't see any problem with her doing that. <laughs> All she has to do is hit the button to turn the record on mm -hmm. and hold it. I'm on my um, gimbal stabilizer, so she ain't got to worry about the camera being lopsided. What do you guys think? She's like, I don't video. All you got to do is just forget the cameras on and just talk about what you see. And I can control him. Get set. Good boy. Okay. <laughs> I know. I know why he doesn't listen to me. Well, I, okay, forward. Yeah, she's trying to get him to sit and sit and sit. And I told him one time and he sat. And he's like, then you wonder why he don't listen to me. She got a point. He's She's got to get her own control over Kit. And it's vital. So, yeah, maybe it's a good idea you don't videotape. You should be stuck with him. I'm getting ready to get my butt kicked. This may be a long video today, but you know what? That's okay. Back some days ago, I scratched the video because it was 15 minutes long. I was like, nobody wants to see a video 15 minutes long. I wanted to turn around and make one 13 minutes in there, that one. You know, I got to quit worrying about that crap. And you know, just do what I do because this is what I do. So if it's long, it's long, man. But let's look at this tree stump tombstone yeah oh wow that's beautiful i gotta touch it gotta put my hands on it wow that's so beautiful see you can't read it though how long it's been here not at all well, this oh wait a minute that says 1830 no it's 1890 this one says 1849. 1849. Baby. Wow. It looks like it's been here that whole time too. Come on. Man. Oh wow. That's beautiful. Oh, another thing of beauty right here, y'all. Look at this. Oh wow. Totally remarkable. As we make our way back to the car, I'm going to tell you what brings us to VV Indiana today. Um, when we was here last time, now we've been to VV multiple times before, many times. But the other day when we was here, we was talking, wouldn't it be cool to kind of live here? It would be a very awesome place to live. It would. Of course, my wife would have to relocate on her job. Yeah, that could be a pain in the butt because she loves the people she works with. Then we come out here today, partially for that reason, uh, we were headed in the books. We was going to visit the cemetery. Uh, we was actually going to visit a, a big yellow duck, but uh, I'm not into big yellow ducks. It was a big thing about it, but guys, I will not share that in my videos. It has something to do with all the Jeeps and the ducks and blah, 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 blah. And then as we was coming through Vivi, can you hear my background, the motorcycles taking off? 
When we was coming through BB, it was wall to wall. Of course, there is a car show going on. There's a lot of peoples. I asked Anch, I said, well, wasn't this busy last Saturday? But still, do you think this is a very busy little town? She didn't think so. Still wouldn't mind living here. It's a beautiful place. And that, yeah, that duck, we turned the camera around. If I could point it out in post, right over yonder there, Michael. Yeah, I'm talking to myself. I'm gonna zoom in. Don't know how well I build a zoom in on post. It may get a little blurry, but right yonder there is that yellow duck. It has something to do with people getting their photos taken next to it. And from what I was gathering, something maybe possibly to do with Jeeps. I don't know. Don't quote me. So I'm probably wrong. And we are parked right down the road. Let's do a full pan around from this point, guys. This is the newer side. And right over yonder here, that's the newer side. And everything through here, I hope I ain't going too fast. Let me back out this way, this would be a better shot. Cause I got a straight line of view, but I'm falling my butt. And everything back this way is the older side. Angie's headed over to the new side to get some pictures. I got Kit with me now. Uh-uh, to me. So guys, this has been today's video. Okay, stay, Bubby, stay. Been today's video. Like I said, I love cemeteries and graveyards. I have that, I don't know what kind of taste you call it. Some people call it creepy, spooky, eerie. I've always had this type of taste. I totally love this stuff. I never feel any more at peace than I do inside of a cemetery or graveyard. And the older, the better. All right, guys, this has been the video for today. Hope you enjoyed. Leave your comments down below. And on the way home, which we ain't going just straight home. No, we never do that. <laughs> on the way home, I see something else of interest. I will get that on video too, and you'll see it. I don't know what day, but you'll see it. Until next time, guys, come on. Let's get out of here. Thank you for watching. Please hit that like button if you like today's content. And it does wonders for my channel. Catch you next time, y'all.